Zona Trendy Golden Globes 2015 durante la semana de los Golden Globes, aprovechamos para sentarnos con parte del talento de E. Conversamos con Juliana Rancic y Chloe Kardashian. So, welcome to E Latin America. Yay! Well, first of all, congratulations. It's been eight years. I like a hundred seasons. Mm -hmm. Are <laughs> you excited? Much. <laughs> Are you excited about this one? I am. I was saying when we, because we just did season nine. Yeah. Which was like 20 something episodes and then we did our Hampton show and I was like oh my god so we literally had three weeks off and then we started production for season 10 I was like what are we even going to film like what else do we have and then of course life things happen <laughs> and there's always something but we always say like oh my god I feel like there's nothing else to shoot or nothing of course there is there's dr drama in my family and it's really true sometimes when the cameras are not there I really feel, I'm like, am I being punked? How, like, do we have this much drama at all times, and even more so when no one's around? So what I really like also is that every girl has their own identity. And a lot of people say, like, Chloe's my favorite one, and I'm on Team Chloe. Thank Obviously, you. because of the, of the girl <laughs> power and everything there. What do you think is your role with your sisters? I don't know. I think the great thing about us is even though we fight, or I think that's common for any sisters, mm -hmm. we're always, like, say I could be fighting with like Kim right now and then if like you came in I would still have her back no matter what like we're never like yeah. we never like wave back and forth we always know we ride or die for each other I feel like um, Kylie is a mini Chloe with, with something else I with know green my mom yells at me all the time she's, <laughs> she's like look what you did to her I was oh, like but I she's, don't know. she's so awesome she's so rad I, I, I so love her blog She's the. She's just so cool. Yeah, yeah. And I love how you girls actually manage uh, your social media. Is that like an extension of the reality for you guys? Well, for us, social media. I mean, it's really a way for us to connect with our fans. So it is an extension of reality, but it's a totally different side because it's more of my personal. So, what are your big three? beauty tip. Well, I am huge on, which is like a new thing, coconut oil. I love to like... On your hair? On my hair. Um, I'm huge on spray tans. Yay. I think it makes you just feel better. I don't go in the sun a lot, so a big spray tan girl. And I mean, I am really, I mean, I'm a workout fanatic. I love working out. I just think mentally yeah. what it do does. Yeah, do you like a cardio or into weights? I do both. Okay. I love to box, though. Boxing <gasps> is my thing. Oh, my God. Love what a box. good clip of you boxing. Uh, you have to social media no, that. I do. I have. You did I've that? done some I'm videos. So, I I, I you got to see. Parts. I've done some <laughs> videos, and which I love, but um, it's therapeutic. Cool. Yeah. That is really great. Hey, thank you. It was a pleasure. Uh, nice uh, seeing right. you. Okay. So, welcome to e Latin America. Thank we're you. Like, like, we're like the cousins. I yeah. love it. <laughs> so, this year, new crew. New team, new set, yeah. new everything in yeah. Fashion Police. Tell me all about it's it. It's amazing. It's amazing. You know, it was hard, obviously, these past several months since losing Joan. Um, but the producers did the smartest thing they could have done, led by Melissa Rivers. Yeah. They said, hold on, we got we to gotta stop this show for a while. Let's let everyone heal and let's let them mourn. And then we'll figure it out. Yeah. And so we've had some time to do that. And... You know, not a day goes by that I don't think about Joan a hundred times a day. And um, But at the same time, Joan was the ultimate professional. Yeah. And she was the ultimate woman who would say, the show must go on. And with Melissa Rivers as our executive producer, I feel really good about that. And I feel that it's going to be a great show, that it's hopefully something that Joan is looking down at us going, good job, yeah. guys, you know, you made me laugh. So we just want to make sure that we do a good job for Joan and that the viewers love the show as well. I just really loved when Joan used to look at you when she was starting and she would say, mm, Juliana, my muffin, puffin, <laughs> loving, 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 whatever she made yes. up the moment. <laughs> she would say the funniest. Yes. Yeah. The funniest. So Joan, you would always say she'd be like, my gorgeous glamazon of, of fashion or whatever. My Italian espresso. Whatever. Yeah, yeah, my Italian cappuccino of, of, of you know, clothing or whatever. And she would always say the nicest, sweetest, funniest introductions on every show. But then I do remember when I was like, one time she was like, Juliana, my bug-eyed beauty. And I went, bug-eyed? Joan! And I yelled at her. It was the funniest thing. And she, she was laughing so hard. That was the best feeling on Fashion Police with Joan was 
when I could make her laugh to yeah. the point where she would like almost fall off her chair, it would just, my heart would explode out of happiness because yeah. I'm like, wow, I'm getting Approval. one of the greatest comedians in the world laughing at me. Like, that's pretty incredible. But Joan was like that. She wanted you to be funny. Yeah. She wanted you to to know that you were funny and that she thought you were great and she was the best. Now, what about the chemistry? Chemistry with you guys now? It's great. I mean, here's the thing. We haven't rehearsed together, but I've known Kathy for years. I've been a huge fan of hers. Kathy is one of the funniest people I've ever yeah. met in my life. She makes me cry laughing. She's so funny, wickedly funny. And she's not afraid to bring it. She will talk about, she, some of her best stand up is about Celine Dion or Britney Spears. I mean, she, she knows all about celebrities and isn't afraid to go there. Brad, I just met. Okay. Um, Kelly, obviously, I know really well, but we'll see. We'll it could see. be a total disaster, <laughs> or it could be the greatest show ever. I have no idea. It's not. It's going to be amazing. So basically, you're the red carpet queen because you're there before, you're there during, mm. and then you're there to talk about it afterwards. That's true. So who do you think for this season is untouchable? We okay. do not want to mess with them because the fans are going to go crazy. And who are you dying to see? Okay. So no one's safe, um, but I am really looking forward to seeing Amal Alamuddin, George Clooney's wife, because, oh. look, of she course. is, yes, Reese Witherspoon's on the red carpet and Jennifer Aniston, all these big stars on the red carpet, but Amal has is the this, whole yes, package. Lupita. What? Maybe, maybe she could be like the fashion goddess yeah. of the red carpet. I predict Amal, because she has amazing fashion sense. What we saw at the wedding was incredible. Yeah. All her changes, the John Batista Valley, the Stella McCartney. I mean, she's an ama she looks fabulous in clothing and, and just beautiful. And she knows her designers. You know, her wedding dress was Oscar de la Renta. So I think, obviously, Amal is going to have her pick of any designer. And she's going to have first choice at, the, at whatever gown she wants. So I expect her to make a real statement on the red carpet. Well, Juliana, this has been so much fun. Thanks, See you, Sandy, at the Golden Globe. Thank you. And honey. you're amazing. Thank you. <laughs> you're taking over. <laughs> I am passing the baton to her. <laughs> <laughs> Así termina esta Zona Trendy especial Golden Globes. Recuerden hacernos saber sus impresiones usando el hashtag Zona Trendy GG. Soy Patricia Zavala y nos vemos pronto.